Hello beautiful people, it's Sherry Moulton back with another video. I am going to do another Dutch pour. I want to apologize, I didn't get a video up yesterday, um, so I'm sorry. Life just gets to me some days. I've been really, really busy getting stuff for that um, art gallery and doing classes, so my mind's been a little bit busy and I apologize. So. We're going to do a Dutch pour on one of those new canvases that I bought. The um, 12 by 16 inch oval that I got from the dollar store. And I've been busy. Um, I restocked. These are all my Dutch pour paints. I've spent two days um, refilling the ones that are half empty. And then I purchased a whole bunch of new colors. And so... Anyways, that's what I'm doing. So I'm going to bring you down and I'm going to let you see what we got. And I will go through all my colors with you. Here, just a sec. There we go. I'm excited. This is going to be kind of cool. So I flooded, um, oh, I guess you want to go this way. I flooded the canvas with my um, acrylic flow white with my Dutch pour mix with the flow trial and water. Um, I will link the video in the description box. And yeah, so I was mixing paints and I, I'm just gonna do um, what I have left over. I have little bits of cups, so I'll show you what I did. And I also bought myself a um, a labeler. So this is Grumbacher, Grumbacher Thalo Blue, isn't that pretty? Um, I have Grumbacher uh, Alizarin Crimson. I have uh, Deco Art Metallics. This one's Peacock Pearl. I've had it, but I don't know why I never mixed it up. I also have Liquid X Basics Thalazine Green with Iridescent Medium. I am just so butchering. And I just love these. Um, Deco Art Glam Dust. This one is Blue Sapphire. They have, I went and I bought every one of them. These aren't in the painting, but I'll have to show them to you. This one is Purple Passion. This one is Pink Neon. This one is Celebration Pink. And I have the Silver bling which i've had before and i've had the blue before so the blue i just had to re um restock so yeah so i'm excited to use other other ones that neon pink would be kind of cool so yeah so i'm going to use these colors because i have them left and we're going to see what becomes of it i think uh because it's so kind of a cool canvas i might yeah no we're just going to go straight down the center so I'm going to you do my um, Thalo Blue first. This color is so pretty. And we will do the Crimson, Algerian Crimson. I'm saying that wrong probably, but it is what it is. We will do the Thalozine green with iridescent medium. We will do the bling. Oh, I'm just going to wipe that green off the edge before I pour it out. The sapphire blue glam dust. And these glam dusts are freaking amazing. Um, if I have one here, I'll show you how they dry because it they just look like glitter. And then I'm going to do the peacock pearl. And let's do a little torch. I bought myself a second torch. It came in today. Just so I have for doing my classes. Bought a second blow dryer. Probably don't need them because with the COVID, they're only allowing four people at a time. So 
not like I need anything special. So. All right, I think this uh, Alzerian Crimson is going to take over. Let me do, just because I really like that blue. Let's just do this really quick. Okay, here we go. Again, I hit the white. I do it every time. Every time. I love that Grumbacher. I'm saying it wrong, but that color is pretty. Actually, this isn't that bad. Let's get in here where the white is. Because we know there's some color in here. Oh, now that's kind of cool. Do, 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 do. And this is another reason why I bought another torch. That is actually kind of sweet. Well, this is cool. I love it because you never know what you're going to get, eh? It's like rolling the dice. I don't think I'm going to touch it. I like it. I love the, the richness of these colors. Um, again, I have to practice doing it without touching my, well, it belonged the white over because I love the richness. Let me just see if I can do a little something, something with this here in the end. There, I like that a little better. Very cool. I wonder if I can bring this over. Oh my goodness, that blue is so rich. Beautiful. I love it. I don't think I'm going to do anything to it. That is pretty cool. So. I'm also excited. I ordered these. I was when I was doing the dipped flowers from um, Miss Beautiful Fiona from Sylvania. When I was doing these badly mishapped things, um, some sweet person um, sent me a link, and I got the cups that she uses. Oh my goodness! Let me see if I can find something that's behind that you can see it with. I don't know if you can see it or not. It is the six-sided. It's scalloped. And oh my goodness, I have to try. So when I ordered it, I will actually, I'm not sure if it's in my um, Amazon shop, but I will make sure it's in there. So I ordered them and they came in one, two, three, four, five of these stacks. So you've got a hundred. So that's kind of cool Enough for me to play with. So yeah, so that's exciting. So I went to, and I dropped off my paintings um, yesterday and I did a three foot by two foot um, bling bling and it was a beautiful um gray and um like a light gray i'm trying to find my container oh here it is um it's this gray and it is a chalk finish so i ended up i because it didn't look very uh because it's not spray paint and the spray paint is basically kind of sealed off as where this paint wasn't so I put a coat of varnish on top of it then I did my bling on it and oh my goodness it is so stunning 
Um, so they were hanging it in the gallery yesterday. So um, I'm hoping that maybe tomorrow I can go in and they'll let me take a little little video and I'll clip that into my next video at the end. So anyways, I'm going to bring you lovely people down. And let's take a closer look at this masterpiece. I have a thought. I know it's kind of scary sometimes, at least my husband would say. I have a thought that I'm going to pause for one minute here. Like, look at that color. That is just beautiful. Grumbacher. I don't know if I'm saying it right or not, but I bought four of them. I bought the um, Thalo Blue. I bought the Prussian or Parisian Blue. I bought a Thalo Green, I think, and that Crimson. That is gorgeous. I like. So I was thinking I have all those little round ones. So you know how people have on their walls the the little round mirrors and they're they're kind of like in a row so i was thinking on doing a video with a bunch of them plastered in a shape like in like a, a curve we'll do like a curve with them with the dutch pour on them so we're gonna see that might come up in a little bit because i think that's cool so Anyways, I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. And again, I apologize for not having a video up yesterday. So I hope this satisfies your little sherry take or whatever. And uh, yeah, so I hope you have a wonderful day. Um, if you have not subscribed, please do. Hit that thumbs up. Hit the bell in there somewhere so you get notifications. And... I, oh, actually, I have something kind of exciting to say. I am probably 800 away from 50. 50,000 people. I have no idea what to say. I am just baffled because I'm going to say maybe f not even three months ago, I did my, four months ago, I did my 1,000. I'm going to do a little video and... I'll actually write everything down and explain it to you because I can't, I still can't believe how my channel has grown over this summer. And I don't know, COVID probably has a lot to do with it. People are home watching, you know, finding things to do. But so I'm going to have a giveaway. I haven't quite decided yet what it might be. I am so tempted to gift a bag of my broken glass glitter that I buy um, for those people that can't get it. I think that would be an awesome thing. Um, I am probably going to gift some form of a painting or maybe some coasters. So we'll see. I'll figure all that out and I will let you know maybe in the next video. So anyways, have a wonderful day. Love you guys. Bye.